Hey guys, welcome to the Lux Report channel. Please subscribe to stay up to date on all the latest happenings in the watch world. You can buy a well-regarded vintage watch right now, wear it regularly for years to come, and provided you don't seriously damage it, you could sell it with little fear of devaluation. In fact, if you're lucky, you might make a decent chunk of change by doing so. And speaking of lucky, did you happen to pick up a vintage Rolex a decade or so ago? Because if you did, well, damn you are lucky. So, according to a recent analysis of historical sales data by Bob's Watches, uh, they say that the Submariner or Daytona has picked up a lot of value over the last decade. And in fact, according to the report, vintage Rolexes appreciated more from 2011 to 2021 than gold and even real estate. Seriously, and while the stock market has grown at a similar rate... Well, it's not like you're going to go and wear your shares on your wrist and check the time on them. If you're a collector or would be would be collector who's been watching the vintage watch market in general these past few years, all this likely comes at no surprise. It's been a boom time for folks involved in the buying and selling of pre-owned watches. And an even boomier time if those watches are of the tooly or sporty variety, like, say, a vintage Rolex chronograph or diver. And as with any market, things could go bust at any given moment for any number of potential reasons. One especially interesting thing about the Bob's Watches report is the spike in value for models ranging from the aforementioned Submariner and Daytona to the Air King and Sky Dweller over the course of the global pandemic. Do folks have a newfound appreciation for time and the way it can seem to stretch out forever? Are they readying themselves for all the appointments we've all had to keep when life gets fully back on track? Or did they just notice that these damn good-looking watches, which, again, you can wear to your heart's content, rather than babying them like a new in-box Star Wars figure, keep gaining value and maybe it's time to get on board? Who knows? But if you've got the scratch and a healthy tolerance for risk, maybe now's the time to start thinking harder about what's on your own wrist. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Please do subscribe to Lux Report. Click on the bell icon, click to receive all notifications, and we will keep you updated on all the latest happenings in the watch world.